Hey guys, it's Ryan from PhoneDog.com. Today I'm going to be looking and checking out, playing around with the LG Dare. It's Verizon's newest Vcast multimedia phone. Um, we already did an unboxing of it, so I can't do that on camera, unfortunately. <laughs> but what I can do is I can show you the phone. It's right here. The Dare is a full touchscreen phone with some physical keys that are on the bottom but most of the controls of the phone are done through touchscreen. The Dare also has a 3.2 megapixel camera, which is probably the best mass market digital camera in a cell phone that is uh, currently out. You also have the spe speakerphone right back there. All right, well, we're going to get into this and check it out. All right, we're going to do a quick little walkthrough of the Dare here. This is the screen when you first see when you first open up the phone. It gives you buttons for the messaging, the phone, main menu, the contacts, and the contact for the favorites. All right, we're going to jump right into the main menu here. The Dare actually has two different themes that you can use. You can either use the black one, which I'm using, or the white one. It changes the entire phone. It's pretty nifty. You have your texting over here. And the really nice thing about the Dare is that it allows you to flick through large lists really quickly, sort of like the iPhone's motion. Um, the Dare is not a multi-touch phone, uh, but it does the flick motion or gesture pretty well. So, pretty cool. Alright, uh, one thing about the LG Dare is that its touch screen is actually a pressure-sensitive touch screen. So, the nice thing about that is people in cold states like I am, um, you don't have to take off your gloves to use it in the winter, which is a really nice touch, because the iPhone, you have to use your actual skin on the device's uh, screen. So that's a really nice feature for people who are in cold states. All right, here's the dial pad. There's a couple different ways you can actually dial. You can actually just dial plain. You can actually say it. Call. Please state the name or number. 555-2866. Yes, that's that. And the other way you can do it is you can also draw it. That takes a little while, but it's a nice little add touch they did. All right. Over in contacts, you have the same, pretty much the same flick motion that you can do over in the messages. So when I set up for contacts because you can click on it and you can call them right there, you can star them, all that kind of stuff. You actually, the star actually means that I put them in my favorites, which I'll show you next. This is it right here. This is the favorites. Um, what you can do is you can just touch your one of your contacts, send them a text or a phone, call them, or you can get the information right there. Okay. We're going to go over to settings and tools. And as you can see, the Dare has really nice animations in between uh, screen changes. So it's nice that Verizon actually let a manufacturer uh, do some work in the UI, because they're usually a pretty closed down, locked ecosystem. All right, what, what we see here is the, some of the main menus. And as you just saw me do, the one thing you can do in the Dare that's really nifty is you can actually slide between menus. So if you're in one way or the other, you just slide. And it works really well. I like that. It's a nice little, nice little add touch. All right. Next, we're gonna go see the browser. The Dare also has an orientation sensor, so it renders the page correctly, and so it also uh, does the keyboard correctly. All right. This is a custom home page, but we'll go over and see how it renders another page. Go to phone dock. All right, as you can see, it's got really fast loading times. Um, I'm in a 3G area. As you can see, I've got pretty good service here. So it's a really nice thing. And uh, the, the LG Dare's browser is actually full HTML. So it renders most sites perfectly. If they have Flash in it, it won't render it, but it can do full HTML. As you can see, this, this little side thing that pops up when I'm scrolling around, that is actually a quick, quick way to go all over the page. So I can go all over the place with that. Pretty nifty. All right. Well, that's the browser. As soon as it exits here. All right. Um, the LG Dare just uses um, Verizon's standard email, which I'm sure you guys have already seen. 
Over here is something else that's pretty nifty. This is the favorites menu. So you actually have two main menus. You have this one plus this one down here. Um, this main menu is locked. The icons stay like that. But this one, you can add whatever you want. So I put my email there, put my pictures, my videos. So if you want to, all you have to do is just touch the screen right there. If you want to change one, you just click this little set button right here. And just click the one I want to change, I'll change the notepad. And then these are all the different icons you can put in there. There's like 50. There's a lot of stuff you can put in there. So, it's pretty nifty. You can do all that. Put all that in there. So, alright. Alright, we're going to do a quick demonstration of the LGD's, LG Dare's camera. I brought a little something over to photograph. It's a very powerful camera, actually. It works really well. All right, we are all set. I'll focus on. We're going to take a picture of this magnifying glass. There we go. And since I have that picture there, I can either save it, I can delete it, or I can send a picture message right away. All right, it's saved, and we'll go over to my gallery and look at it. And there it is. The LG DR's orientation sensor also rotates pictures, so you can get the full effect of pictures. And you can also, it's got a whole suite of uh, image editing tools. You can crop it, change all that good stuff about it. All right. Well, that was my review of the LG Dare. If you want any more information about the Dare or any of its competitors, head on over to our site at uh, phonedog.com. There you can get all the information about the latest cell phones, all the different carriers. So uh, head on over to phonedog.com and check it out. And thanks for watching my review of the LG Dare.